Well, there are at least 2.7 million Americans living with atrial fibrillation, or AFib. It's an irregular heartbeat that can lead to blood clots, stroke, heart failure, and other heart-related complications. That's according to the American Heart Association. It's a condition some experts call an epidemic. I would have um, shortness of breath. Um, I would have, um, I could feel my heartbeat. I, I was very aware of my heart rate, you know, being irregular. Those symptoms led Dana Trawick to Dr. Tom Wallace, a cardiac electrophysiologist with CHI St. Vincent. Most of the time, patients who have electrical issues have palpitations, so they'll feel their heart fluttering or flipping or flopping. The retired school teacher from Hot Springs has atrial fibrillation. Trawick isn't alone. Dr. Wallace says AFib is very common. It's become an epidemic, especially in folks as they age. Ages 60 or older, we're seeing it more and more and more. And it's caused by you know, all kinds of issues, you know, from obstructive sleep apnea to uh, an overactive thyroid. Sometimes it's just uh, a condition that the heart has as it ages. The meds and the and the uh, the ablation have controlled my AFib. Um, I really don't. I don't have any issues when I exercise now. Quality of life is great. With treatment, she's been able to get back to working out and encourages others with AFib symptoms to get checked. I feel great. Mm -hmm. I feel really good. That's a gift. If you have symptoms that you think could be AFib, the first step is talking with your doctor.